Jesus Christ, how long is this game? You know what? I'm done. Two hours. Well... You know what? I, I don't know how long this game is. While this is happening, let me how, let me see how long the, cha the chapters are. Yeah, definitely not. This is the last chapter. <laughs> so that so this will be the last one. Good. <coughs> the voice. I can't hear what? the voice anymore. <laughs> Why are you staring at me like that? What have I done to you? I've, I've just pat you. You've been laying there, basically passed out. Now you're licking yourself. And I've been patting you the entire time. You are trapped. Okay. This way. No. Stand up. Don't sit Whoa. there. Come on. My friend's cat's sitting in front of the TV. Oi. You make a better there? door than a window. Hey. Who are you? Ah. Where am I? I don't know. In a cave? Looks like a cave. The miraculous catch was a trap. Leviathan wanted to be found. Okay. okay, do I have... I can't press it, okay. To our fallen crew members. They have given their lives for a greater purpose. The last name added is that of Charles Hawkins. This monument is gruesome. There's a painting down here. Oh, look at his eyes. <sighs> Who painted it? Probably Sarah. Hello. How are you? It will soon be time, Edward Pierce. You are yeah. dead. Oh. Colden? None of this is real. I saw you dead. As I see you now. Am I crazy too? You survived. Don't you understand? You couldn't die. You will stay alive until you've fulfilled your destiny. No. Look at me. Look at me, Pierce. Dare tell me that you still don't believe it. No. <laughs> when I was eight, my little brother fell from the apple tree. He was bleeding. I took care of him. That very day, I decided to become a doctor. I never reneged on my oath. That's what led me to Darkwater. The people here needed oh. me. I died trying to save one of them. 
Help me give them a second chance. Embrace the power of this sleeping god. You're out of your mind. It's not just your life that is at stake. Many men and women have sacrificed themselves for this moment. Colden! You will not deprive them of their hope of a better life. I saw what Leviathan did to Fuller. We will all die like him. His life was written well before it started. It was not predetermined that he lived to see the call. But you? Yes. It is your destiny. He's painting. I'm gonna keep going. I understand now. Like you, I was called here by a higher power. Yes. All your choices had the sole purpose of preparing you for the final decision. I must make a choice. Not just make a choice. The, the right choice. choice. Not yet, but soon. Okay. We have one more thing to accomplish. What? What's up? I must take you to Sarah Hawkins, our Oracle. Why? Hehe. <laughs> Again. I feel her calling me. Let us not wait any longer. Not yet. I may. You have one last thing to accomplish. No. Please. Do you understand what it is? She has already fulfilled her mission. Worry about your own. No. No. No one can fight their faith. Neither them, nor you. Uh, what's happening? Wear headphones, this is actually really cool. Shut up! Silence! Stop! Go away! Stop! Stop! I've been trying to get him to lose his in uh, sanity. Resist, Edward. They're already dead. There's nothing you can do. Just give in. Am I just gonna give in or I'm just gonna kill her? What happened to me? Sarah. I must go to Sarah. She is the Oracle. She will know what to do. Which is probably this way. I can't I can't even look at my sanity. Dead quiet. I like that, just walking through a cave and it's gone dead quiet. I love it. Absolutely love it. It's only 8.50, fucking hell. So now all of it was caved in. Unless this is another one. Oh. Reality as you know it stops here. None of this makes sense. Go. She is waiting. I am. No, what I have done to you is made you completely lose your sanity. Ah, Mr. 
Oh, hello. I was expecting you. Fuller. You died in front of my eyes. Don't jump to conclusions. Is there not the tiniest spark of a scientific mind inside of that detective skull of yours? What abject substance did you use to turn her into an empty shell? Abject substance? The serum extracted from Leviathan's oil bestows the power of life. To me, my body is nothing but the mortal vessel of my conscience. To you, it contains more answers and secrets than your insignificant mind can grasp. Okay. This is such a cool game. You stand up and yet here you are. You never give up. That is not yeah, no you. shit. Not anymore. Not since your disappearance on the docks. Ah, detective. So easy to fool you. So eager to rush to the rescue of a woman in distress. <laughs> you won't make me regret having tried to save people. I did what I could. Even for Colden. Your efforts to change your destiny, although in vain, make you worthy of the fate that is yours. The day has come. You will be asked to choose. I still can't do it. My sanity should be absolute zero. <laughs> Hello, Hawkins. Charles! You took everything from me. Wife. Life. Destiny. You forsook your right to a normal life. The moment you chose power over humanity. No one wants to see such an unbearable sight. You don't have the slightest idea of what you speak. Of what I've been through. I have sacrificed my life to the one who sleeps. My marriage, my family, my own flesh. Why didn't okay. Sarah choose me? Why is it your damn face on her painting? I don't know. But you already know it. I can see that you will make the right choice. I don't know. I don't know. Your fear of the unknown and your stupid pride cloud your judgment. Quit lying to yourself and embrace your destiny. It's not cowering that brought you those medals. None of this is real. Trust your guts. If nothing's real, what are you? I am a projection of your mind. What remains of that instinct that pulled you out of the trenches. Don't listen to uh. them. They're too dangerous for your tired mind. Nah, our uh, daddy ending. <laughs> I'm almost there. I know. So you're not gonna attack me this time? <laughs> Let you outside in a minute. Let me just finish the game.
Here you are at last, Truth Seeker. She was waiting for you. You were waiting for me. Yes. When I finally discovered the truth, I knew you would come. <laughs> All this time I was fighting it, afraid of what I might discover. But I was afraid of myself. It's coming. What did you learn? <laughs> Listen to me, Edward Pierce, as I will deliver the truth. Yes. I have seen things. Strange and horrifying, but always true. Will you trust my words? Yes. One man, Yay. one man only prepared by the trials and revelations, holds the power to change the world. Because I saw you in the dreams I share with my God. I recognize you for what you are. A truth seeker. One of the rare humans who is able to perceive fragments of his mind. Yes, yes. I feel the truth in your words. Because it was written. Or, as I like to see it, painted on the canvas of fate. Pierce, help me! the one that I chose? Ah! That's the blade that I chose to defeat the Shamblo. Perform the ritual. Hello, Fitzroy. Wait, is that Fitzroy? I didn't come all this way, lose my sanity just to perform a counter one. Who are you? Oh. I thought it was on the other dude. Oh, there he is. Night is ripped. There we go. Wake, slumber one. I want to see Dad. I 
Hello. Catherly. Awesome. Well, is that it? No. Okay, I'll shut up then. No, I'm not gonna shut up. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna say that. Now. Why are they fighting? A God of War scene. <laughs> well, there's Sarah Hawkins dead, the Oracle. Probably killed by my hand. That it? That's it. Sick. But we only got to see Daddy once. Oh. Okay. Oh, good. Well, that's the end of this. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.